Hey guys, it's me Paige and welcome to another video and this might be the last, maybe last, I'm not really sure, back to school video of 2019 and I really don't like doing these type of videos but it feels odd for me to do back to school videos without doing a friggin' haul. I have at least made one video of back to school supply haul every single year. I think last year I only uploaded a back to school supply haul video. Yeah, I only uploaded a back to school haul video last year. But I am back here stronger than ever. My school supply is weaker than ever. And um, even though this might be the most boring haul, um, I hope you guys really enjoy it because I'm probably not going to enjoy editing this. I'm really not. I just want to sleep. Every year I have gotten a backpack for a certain purpose, either whether it's cute or it's going to help me in some function at school. Last year I got a can, -can backpack. This is the part where I'm going to talk about why I didn't like using the can, can backpack during my school year. But honestly, I don't want to get in trouble by talking hate about this brand, so we're just going to skip this part. This year, I went even more basic, and I got the same... The same? No, I did not. I got another yellow backpack. It's a weatherproof... So heavy. A weatherproof backpack. Um, my campus is outside, and even if it rains, we still have to walk in the rain. So I decided to go on Amazon and get this really bright yellow to cut the story short the reason why i have this new yellow three pocket pencil pouch is because uh my one from freshman sophomore year broke so i had to get a new one off of amazon bright yellow travel pouch the reason why i'm saying it's a travel pouch because on amazon there are no pencil pouches that have three pouches in it i got my old pencil pouch from a trip to spain madrid i don't even know but I guess it wasn't really a pencil pouch. I guess it was a travel pouch. Because on Amazon, there are only two pocket pencil pouches. But I want a three pouch. So I just had to get a travel pouch. I don't even know. I just like three pouches because it's so much handy. And I could separate my pens, pencils, and sticky notes. So I don't have random things laying in my bag. You know what I mean? So I got this pink stapler. I found it so much easier in high school to use a mini stapler than just going up to your teacher and asking to borrow their stapler that is behind their desk. And it's kind of embarrassing, but kind of not. Having a mini stapler is kind of funny too in some way because I made a lot of friends. I made friends having a mini stapler? Are you kidding me? I'm not sure when I started using these Candy Pop Paper Mate pens, but these are honestly the freaking bomb. I love these pens so much. They're so nice to write with. And also, I like decorating my notes. I don't really know why I bought all of these highlighters. Because I have a lot of freaking highlighters still. But I decided to get these large jumbo Sharpies in all these colors. I love highlighting. And I love, like I said, I love organizing my notes and making it look personal and more attractive, I guess. I don't even know. But I got this rainbow set of Sharpies. And I probably don't need all of these Sharpies. But I will use them during my senior year I guess so most of my school supplies I've been buying are school supplies I already have in my house but I didn't realize I do already so I guess I have a lot of more index cards but I found it so much more organized to have these colorful index cards whiteout is your best friend in high school honestly there's not a lot of teachers that hate their students using whiteout but honestly whiteout is your best friend when you mess up on your notes because I hate doing the little scribbles on notes it's really annoying so whiteout is your best friend in high school <laughs> this is just a personal item but I have hand sanitizer and Altoids these Altoids the Arctic um yeah the Arctic ones that are strawberry flavored are so freaking good they're so nice and it's they're so good. I used a lot of sticky notes last year, and I used them a lot for mainly my language class to write notes, and also I wrote most of my homework on post-it notes and put on my notebook. I know that's kind of unorganized, but there's nothing really to say about post-it notes except that they're just post-it notes. I got these Papermate Inkjoy pens. These are also my favorite. These were my number one favorite pens in during my freshman year i didn't use them last year for some reason because these pens cost a freaking lot of money probably these pens are so freaking good and they just write so nicely it i don't know why but there's some pens that i cannot write with and it just doesn't feel comfortable i don't know why i bought this cool little um lemon eraser but we're just gonna go with that i have saw these erasers since bethany moda's 
supply hauls. These are honestly the best erasers and they erase anything and you will not be sorry in your math class. <laughs> Just the extra things that I didn't show in this haul is that yes, I'm going to be bringing pencils and I have glue and other pens but those are all just going to be reused school supplies so yeah my teachers don't give out a school supply list i don't know any high school that gives out a school supply list but teachers normally don't even tell their students what they need till the first day of school let me just say target was so difficult to find wide rule notebooks for because their sizing was so odd this year it wasn't a normal wide rule notebook first we're going to start with the composition books so I just got this plain yellow one that is, it's just a composition book. It really, it's, there's, there's no specialty to it. It's just a composition book. But I did get this, um, blue one that says you can sit with us. Cause positive vibes while you're in school, there's a lot of bullies out there and we need to spread some positive vibes. I'm so freaking annoying. Now for the wide ruled notebooks. I hope they're all wide ruled. What? What? I hope all my notebooks are wide ruled because if they're not, I'm just going to be very upset because I threw away the receipt for all of my school supplies this year. Most of the notebooks I got were very just the plain Target notebooks. So I just got a red one, a blue one, a green one and a orange one that's really it i probably won't be using all of these during the school year i think the ones that have nice designs on them are the notebooks that motivate me a lot during school i don't know why it's probably because they look cute and make me feel excited to do school that probably is just me but um i got this balloon animal one then i got this white notebook that says passing notes with these paper airplanes for some reason this reminded me of laura jean and like to all the boys i love before they should have made to all the boys i love before school supplies i wouldn't be mad of having noah centineo's face on my notebook that is what i have for notebooks this year I have two folders. I have two folders because, um, to be honest, I don't know why I bought half of these school supplies, but I will eventually use them all by the time I graduate high school. So I got this cute little corgi one of them and all in costumes. I get these cute ones every year just because. And I use this just to put like other, like just to put extra papers in it or if a class ends up using it, every class ends up using one of these cute little folders. And I honestly think the five star folders are the best folders, probably because of this little flap here that holds all the papers and the little pouches right here. So I just got a yellow one. There's one thing I forgot to show in this haul. <laughs> Most of you do not know that I have an iPad Pro. I've had an iPad Pro since 8th grade and it's starting to get worn down probably because um, I don't take care of my things. But this year I'm going to because I got a new iPad in which this is a giveaway. I am totally kidding right there. I do not have enough money to buy an iPad for a subscriber and I don't have that many subscribers. So no giveaway. <laughs> But I did get a new iPad. I got the, don't even know what iPad this is. Really, you can tell how much I pay attention and take care of my things. This is a bit smaller to my old iPad. My iPad is about the size of this folder, my old one. It looks like a laptop to be honest. And it's very good for Netflix and FaceTiming. But um, it's starting to get worn down and the battery life isn't working and it's just starting to get old in general. I never talked about this, but I don't use books in my high school. We all have ebooks and most of our assignments are online. It's kind of bad, but technology is growing and I have nothing against technology. <laughs> so this is the iPad Air. I got it in space gray and I wanted to get the rose gold one, but I honestly rather not get the rose gold one when i went to the apple store and got this ipad it was like student something partnership i guess and you know what i got for free i got some freaking beats for free guys i never really owned wireless beats before they had a bunch of other colors like blue and yellow which seems pretty cool but i might 
use these for music be music as a meaning cover songs and original songs so this is the end of the haul i know this haul was very boring and i'm probably gonna hate editing this as much as you watching this for some reason i just want to sleep so i hope you guys like this video this might be the last back to school video i am not sure because i got a lot of requests to do a first day of school vlog which i'm probably not gonna do because I don't like filming at school sometimes. So I will see you guys next Saturday. And um, what is it? Um, that was the worst one ever. Okay. Bye. <laughs>